Hello my friends, it's Iberia, and I'm here in the inn, the one in Limsa Limenza. I just kind of like how this one has like this full wall of windows, and it's very open. Not that which inn I'm in matters, but today I wanted to actually look through my glamour dresser and see which items I own have two die channels and which ones don't and just play around and see how they die this is something i have not done yet i was excited for two die channels with dawn trail coming out but i've been really busy doing like battle content i think when the game first came out my goals were kind of like get my healers leveled up get a tank leveled up do hunt trains um, get the shared faiths done, and then do the extreme trials, kind of like all those things, and then I farmed one of the extreme trials a ton, but I didn't get the wings. I literally did a hundred runs, and I didn't get the wings. I saw them drop once, and I lost, of course. So that was really unfortunate. Um, now I have to wait for them to come out via the NPC, but yeah, I just was doing a lot of different things. Now I'm kind of raiding. I do get a little overwhelmed with it. Um, it's hard to explain, but it, it can be quite tiring um, to do something for hours straight that requires a fair bit of focus. And it's a social event, I guess you could say, and I'm an introvert, so I do... Uh, my batteries do run out. But yeah, I've been doing a lot of stuff in the game. Also working on uh, crafters and gathers. I don't, I'm not an omni crafter by any means, but I like to get uh, my gathers up and at least one crafter so I can meld. So I did a lot of stuff that had nothing to do with glam. And there's also not a ton of glam that was released with Dawn Trail, so I didn't really. I didn't- I just haven't done this yet, and I know a lot of people like my glamour videos on my main channel, so I thought possibly it could be fun to do, like, my favorite pieces that have two dies or something, like the ones I think die the best, or maybe are the most versatile in the way that they die. Funnily enough, I thought possibly doing the opposite of that and talking about the worst pieces could be fun too, because I did find one that the way that it dies is just kind of dumb um so we'll see i'm not sure what's gonna come out of this but i did want to go ahead and just explore see what we could find and i will open a document just a word document in my browser Just to keep track if there's any pieces that have two dies that really stand out to me or if it's a piece that I really love that I'm excited for it to be double die just to kind of keep those uh, keep track of those so let's get in the glamour dresser and just look I'm gonna go ahead and do edit glamour plate because I think that'll be the easiest way and then I can just look through stuff so we're gonna make sure this says all and we don't want to start with weapon. Let's start with the body pieces because I think those are the most exciting. So this is one of the new ones from Dawn Trail. So I already knew that it had double dies, but let's see what happens if we do. So let's just reflect that real quick and then let's go back. And this way, you can swap them. I think this one dies pretty cool, but this was expected because it's new. A lot of these we see are still single dies. Um, this is the artifact gear. Looks like from Endwalker. Let's see how that dies. I think all of the artifact gear got double dies. I'm gonna make, yeah, let's go with pink. Okay. 
Let's just reflect that. Have a look. And then swap. So it kind of looks like the fur trim and some of these details get dyed. I do like that though. That they've made. Okay, this one I'm excited for because it's Dancer. Wow, I never did the summoner quest from Endwalker. That's crazy. Sorry, which part of this even double dies? I don't get it. Wait, is it this part? It's literally the necklace. Okay, that's... I think it's the necklace and maybe the chains in general. Yeah, that's kind of ridiculous. I don't know how I feel about that one. It's kind of lame. I guess there's not that much they can do with it because the whole piece itself... Okay, I, I guess I get it. I feel like maybe the trim would have been... I don't know. It's fine. <gasps> That's pretty. Oh my god. Sorry, what if I use, um, pure what? Oh! <gasps> Oh, that is so pretty. I love it so much. I think I like it better as like pink and white, not white and pink, if that makes sense. I like it better like this. But it's very pretty both ways. I didn't really want to include the artifact gear in the video, whatever video I make of my favorites, but... This one is so pretty. Like, it turned out really nice. Okay, I wrote it down because I just think it's so pretty. Even though, I, like, in general, my goal is really more to look for pieces that come from dungeons, the Mog Station, Alliance raids, uh, crafted in game, just like stuff in the game, not necessarily, I mean, obviously the artifact pieces are in the game, but kind of like stuff that feels like, I was going to say that everyone can wear, but that's not true. I don't know how to explain it. I just felt like the artifact pieces were, were not what I would include since they're so tailored to one specific job, but some of them are like really good. Let's see how this one goes. Okay, that's not bad. This one's cute too, but... I feel like it's just because the designs of these... I mean, this is still really pretty. I feel like this trim should be way more pink though. Like this... And this should be the same color. I feel like the design of the white mage one just happens to work really well with the two die system and that's why it looks so nice. The sage one is just okay. Let's see. Wow, the blue mage one too. It looks like the trim dies, this cut part of the collar dies. This one's not that good. I mean, it, it's good in the sense of like, you get some two die channels, but it's not, it doesn't stand out to me. Let's see, all of these are one. 
Okay, this one I haven't checked out. Okay, so it's the same as the uh, level 90 one, where it dies like the chains. But this one I think is nicer because the chains are like thicker, so you can really see the dye on the chains. And it's nice because the chains were always gold. Now you can choose what color you want them to be, so if you like silver better. Obviously, the chains never become straight up white, right? But this one's pretty nice. Okay, let's keep going. Another blue mage one. I don't think I even need to look at that. I guess I'm kind of curious, so... Yeah, okay, that one's actually kind of nice. Changes the sleeves and these little details here. I think that might be it for... Oh wait, no, there's still some artifact gear to be found. Again, really only the white mage one has been really special. <laughs> this is like the tiniest little bit of trim in the backpack in the back. It's not bad, but it's not that impressive either. Okay, okay, okay. Here's... See, this stuff is what I wish would have two die channels. All the tactical stuff, it's literally a crime that they didn't prioritize giving these two die channels. Especially since they gave us Solution 9 and this is like the Solution 9 outfits. Like, they, I, I swear to God, they made these for Solution 9 for the purpose of Endwalker. Or not Endwalker, Dawn Trail. And then they didn't prioritize them with the double die system. It makes no sense to me. But here we have the bunny bustier thing. Okay, so this one it's some small details. If you look, we have the bow and this little detail there. And these, so that's cute. How did it die before? Oh, was the bow just always red then? Huh. I like, I do like that you get that option to dye the bow. Let's see how the other one does. Let's try this. Oh, okay. At first I couldn't tell what part even died because I used, you know, white and pink. That's fun. I like that. This one I would literally never wear. I don't even know why I have it in my glamour dresser. I should probably take it out. I think this one would be a popular choice for a lot of people. Okay, so this one I think you get the bow. Okay, the bow in the back detail. That's fun. I think this one is one that a lot of people like. I feel like I see a lot of people wear this. I'm gonna write it down with a question mark just because I know people like it. It's not something I would consider my favorite, but like I said, I know a lot of people really like this jacket, so... Okay, let's see how this one dies. It looks like the inside of the cape is what changes. Yeah, just the inside of the cape, it seems. It's fine. 
I guess it's nice if you... If you just always, like... Hated the way that looked. Oh, this is die two. I won't die one. Yeah, I think this is cool if you hated that it was red all the time. Because now... You can make it match. It actually looks super cool in pitch black. I actually really like that. I might actually add this to the list. I think it's really fun. Like, I don't know, maybe it's just because I made it black. Let's just try a regular old soot black. Okay, so without any dye, it's red. Actually, a lot of times I would wear it like this, but... It looks really cool. It's such a simple thing, but... I think it's nice that you can literally just be like, Nope, I don't want it to be a different color. And have it match. Scion Traveler. Alright, a pointed jacket. So this Scion Traveler's jacket is a reward for being subscribed for a certain amount of time and this one is from custom deliveries so let's see yeah it looks like the detail that becomes dyed is just this is that really it seems like it seems like there might is there a part on the inside of the jacket no that's... meh. Okay, this one I'm excited for. Let's see how this one dies. Um... Oh, okay. I think I should change this away from white, because it's kind of difficult to tell what parts are what. Should we try green? We can have a cute little green and pink moment. We're gonna just make sure we reflect that so it saves it here. I was kind of hoping it would be the tattoo that would die. This just dies the inside of the sleeve. And this little piece here, again, it's... It's fine, but it's not that special and I would probably not waste a second die on it. Oh, I guess. I guess. Because the sleeve stays red. I can see it. You know what? I guess that's nice. Sometimes I have to go back and see how they used to be. Okay, the spring dress. This one is good. And we know it's good because we've seen... What? <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Um, but we know it's good because we have seen Yoshi P. And these aren't like the coolest colors to use, but like if make make one of them like black. Like how cool is that? Right? Certain colors looks really cool. Let's go back to pink. Uh I don't know which one I made pink and which one I made. <laughs> They're both black now. Uh, I was gonna go for white, but I won't. White and pink. Again. So this one I think is one of my favorites. I think it dies really nicely. Even though it's just the trim details, it works so well. It's really cute. So that's that one. Oh, Avenarian Bolero. Interesting. So it seems like, because I noticed they didn't really do any dungeon gear. That's just an ugly color combination, I think. But I do like how it dies. You have to go back to white here. I 
I get it, but I think it's kind of weird. The reason I think it's weird is because the way the bottom changes color, like this is pink. And see, this is not pink, it's like some weird off shade. But if I swap it, now this part is gray, like you can tell this part dies too, but... I think this one would be really particular with the colors that you'd have to choose to make it look nice. Um, anyways, I noticed they didn't really do dungeon gear, but it looks like they are definitely doing crafted gears, because these are all like, just crafted glams. Okay, this one too is the chain. And these details, which as you can see are normally gold, but I actually think that's really nice. What if we did pink and like a darker pink? Like that. That's kind of fun. And if the first pink... No, I kind of like the pastel better. I actually really like how this looks. I think it's fun to have like the deep pink. This one is quite nice too. I don't know if it's like a favorites level, but it's good. I think I'm gonna write it down with a question mark. I'm actually quite interested to see how the sleeves of this one would go. Okay, let's do tie one and tie two. Let's reflect it so we can play with those colors. I love it. <laughs> So it is the same idea as you just get to dye the metal bits. Wait. We have to see the legs. Hold on. Something I have always wanted was for these bottoms, for this part along the legs, the ties, to dye. Let's see. I hope it's not just this gold part. Oh, it is. It's not the whole leg wrap. That's a little disappointing because sometimes I feel like this wrapped part would look really nice with certain outfits, but it's the wrong color. Oh, that's too bad. Let's finally just do the boots since we're here. Okay, these are interesting because in the past, I think the only part that died was this light pink. Now you get the whole shoe. I definitely think that makes these shoes more versatile, but they are metallic, which is kind of awkward. It might not look good with everything. And weirdly, I don't think it looks good with its... I don't think this looks good together. I think it has to keep... Some part has to stay, like, the same. Okay, this part, let's keep... Dyed like that, and then... Yeah, see? It only matches if you match... To these straps. But I do think you could match these shoes with other things. Just... This part doesn't work if you try to dye it the way that I had it before. Okay, moving on. Let's see what's next. Okay, this is an event piece. So now it's a mog station piece. Dye one. Let's make pastel pink I too. Let's keep like that. Okay, that's not bad. Again, I wouldn't say I'm like super hyped about it, like, oh, it's so cool, but it's definitely decent. I think it's cuter this way than it is this way. But, you know, preference, right? I'm surprised they didn't make this one two dies. 
This, I think, is also a crafted one. <gasps> That's really pretty. I actually really like that. Now I'm curious about how it dies normally. Okay, so normally this inside part would just stay white. Regardless. So the difference is it dies these flowers on the front, it dyes this back part, and then obviously the other color you choose is this. This one dies really nicely. Like, look how pretty this combination is right here. I love this. Oh. Might put this one down too. Because I actually think this is super pretty. Oh, it looks like this trim here also. But I think, yeah, this trim just matches whatever the main color is. There's still some gold in it, which is kind of awkward how this part is like, but it does match because they put a little bit of it up there. Still, I really like that one. <gasps> this used to be one of my favorite tops. Hold up. Oh, no, that sucks. That sucks because of this gray part in the middle. We need a third die. <laughs> Three die system when. Yeah, okay, this one I got really excited about, but here's the thing. I think it would be super cute because I like this. I like the kind of trim details. It's just that, like, this part in the middle should match the trim, right? Like, it shouldn't be this, like, weird random color. It should be, like, for this one, it should be light pink. Like, it should be. Or, like I said, they implement a three die system. This one I don't like kind of disappointed in that one. Actually, I would consider this one of the worst. <laughs> like, it's not terrible, but it's kind of bad. I'm gonna not say worst, I'm gonna say disappointing. I'm gonna make it be like the most disappointing to die items. Ah, uh, this is some Hamish wool no. shirt. Okay, yeah. Super disappointing. Alamegan gown. Okay, interesting. Which... Okay, so it's just the inside shirt. It looks like it's just the inside shirt that dies. And then some parts also get affected by this color, which... Like, this part is affected by the darker pink. But it's mainly the inside shirt. That changes. Okay, interesting. See, and again, this one is disappointing because this um, shirt on the inside dies so dark and weird. Like, why doesn't the shirt on the inside... Like, if I have light pink and dark pink, shouldn't the shirt on the inside be like this cherry pink? Like, why... But it's just these details. It looks kind of better like this, but then you hardly even get like, I don't get why is it the buttons that die and not the shirt. Let's just see how it did this one. Okay, so it's always been kind of bad. <laughs> it's always been kind of bad, but it's weird because when you see the original, it's white. So you'd think it has the opportunity to be like, a light color, but it's not. This one's going in the disappointing category. Okay, this too. Okay, this one also kind of sucks. <laughs> Like, I think what we would have really wanted was this brown trim to change. So that's also disappointing. Because this brown trim looks really bad with certain colors. Like, look how bad it looks with the cherry pink. But imagine if you could dye it like a different color, like white, or like if it matched the pink on the inside. It's disappointing. The 
This one is just the belt. It's neither bad nor good. It's kind of whatever. Okay, this one, I'm, I'm gonna guess they're gonna make the necklace change color. Uh, just the string. <laughs> oh wait, maybe the little middle part too. Yeah. It's the string and the gem. This is like a, a moment where it just feels like they didn't really know how to make this two dies because it's such a simple shirt. So they just did that. I can't blame them. Okay, this one I like, except the fur color is kind of weird. Like, you can see the fur color is supposed to be, like, matching the lighter color, like, whatever this outer color is. But in, with some of them, it just looks dirty. Like, it just looks dirty. It's good otherwise. I don't think it's disappointing enough to be put in the disappointing video, but... Okay, this one I'm excited for. I hope it's the belt that changes color. Let's see. Oh god, no, are you serious? It's not the whole belt, it's just the scarf on the belt. That's actually so frustrating. I want to know, like, why they did this. Like, who made these choices? Why couldn't they... Why couldn't they do the whole belt? I don't get it. This one is going in disappointing. I love that shirt. But like, the belt being brown kind of makes it something where again, it feels like maybe you can't necessarily match it with everything. So the fact that it doesn't change is like, kind of really annoying. Let me just double check real quick just to make sure. Let's do this. But let's make die two. Um, let's make it the same. Oh yeah, no, we had it going. Let's. I just want to make them the same color real quick to see if it makes it better. The answer's not really. I mean, it is initially this dingy color, but it's a slight improvement. It's just still kind of disappointing because it. <laughs> Oh my god, I hope the tattoo. Let the tattoo die. Let the tattoo die. Yes! Oh my god, guys. Wait. Oh my god. Yes. 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 So much yes. This one's a favorite. We do not have enough dyeable tattoos in this game. This is fantastic. I actually really quickly want to just check, um, I'm just gonna put this top on so I can just check. There's a piece, some gloves, this, how do these die now? Oh, there's still only one die. Me out here like, yeah, this, this is okay. These tattoos do die, but you can't dye the black. I, this one needs to have two dyes. It would be amazing. Okay, this one we all hated when it came out like we love the design but we hated this fringe did they fix the fringe or will this be the greatest disappointment of all time yes <gasps> yes they fixed it they fixed the fringe they fixed it oh my god that's so cute i'm so happy about that that also has to become a favorite Ten out of ten. This was what we wanted the entire time. Code of happiness. There's so much to look through still. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, that's... Looks better like that. That one's okay. I don't mind it. Let's see what they chose to do for this one. I think it's going to be the yellow part. Yes. Oh, and the suspender. So the shirt itself doesn't die. 
That makes me wonder, how did it die before? Okay, so before it was just that. Now you get the suspenders. That's cute, though. I like that. I don't know if I'd call it a favor. Well, I don't know if I call it a favor, but I actually do really like it. I think the addition of the suspenders is really cute. And then if we ever get a three die system, five, ten years from now, we get the shirt underneath. Okay. I'm curious now again how this one used to die. Okay, so it used to just leave this. That's a good change. That's a good change because I think it looks way nicer if you don't have to have that ugly, like, puke color. <laughs> that color before was really ugly. This is nice. You can kind of tell which ones I don't wear that often because I'm like, how did it die before? This one I literally never wear. I probably should just put it somewhere else. I think it dies nicely though. It does the way you would expect it to, for the most part. Okay, this one. I'm surprised they made all of the islands. Oh, that's cute. <gasps> I like that a lot. That's so cute. That it, you'd get to choose the color of the flowers. Again, I, w I don't think it d belongs in my favorites just because this isn't a shirt that I like really would wear that much, but I do think it's good. And this one looks to be the same where you choose the flower color. I do like this shirt quite a bit more. Maybe I should put them there. I don't know. I'm like, oh, these are good. Dye is really cute. I also just really like this one. I really like the addition of the suspenders. I think I'm going to put them. <laughs> I'll put question marks. I, I don't know. I'm going to put them for now. And if the list gets too long, I'll have to cut it down. You can tell every time I tab out of the game because the music goes away. It's just how I have it set up. Okay, this one is also great. Like, it does die how you would expect it to, but it's good. Like, it's really nice. It's really cute. Oh, tempting, tempting. It's just not one of my... Oh, well, oh, oh. <laughs> why should I put it there? It's not a shirt that I wear a lot, but I think it dies really cute now. Let's just double check how it used to. Is it just one color? Oh, but this is the wrong one. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, oh, ah, oh, no, I took a... <sighs> this is the one I want to get rid of. Yeah, it used to stay black, so this is kind of a nice change. You can quite change the look of this so it's like you really it makes a big impact this is another one from island sanctuary i believe this one was crafted but all of these were island sanctuary i think this was msq i don't remember or maybe it's not msq maybe it's um crafted i feel like I feel like it comes out of a box, actually, like a loot box. I don't remember what from. I have no clue. Don't remember. Okay, but this one is from Island Sanctuary. I'm kind of curious as to how it dies with just one. Okay, so the middle part is kind of dark. Let's see what they chose to do. Okay, so this middle part still dies with like outer color and then it's just okay it's okay this one i get they're probably gonna do the flowers again so if we just do one color it just does the base two colors did it just dye that single flower <laughs> it's kind of awkward not as good as I expected. This is also Island Sanctuary. A lot of people really like this piece. So one color just dies the base. Two colors. 
you get like a little bit of trim. Again, it's not that impressive. It's fine. How is this two dies? That's so funny. It's gonna die this one little thing, isn't it? No. It died the buttons. That's stupid. I would call it disappointing, but it's it's weird. It's a weird it's a choice. So this one, if you die it. Oh, it's probably gonna die this part. Let's try. Yes. It's kind of weird how it remains black in the back though. I wouldn't say it's straight up disappointing, but it's also like not the best, you know? I'm guessing this one will have the same vibe. Uh it's gonna die these pieces and these. Yep. That's exactly what it did. I mean this one, let's be real, there's not a whole lot to die. I kind of don't understand why it doesn't die the black, but I wouldn't really call it disappointing. Okay, now it's time to open the armor. None of these die. Okay, songbird. Chickens. <laughs> Alright, let's see. If we just dye it one color, it just dyes that undershade. Two colors. Um, oh, okay. I think it's this part underneath. Yes. What about the bow? So it looks like the bow, it depends on like whatever the main color is. So the colors that get changed are this front bow, this under piece. It does look nice if you pick your colors right. Like with the darker color under, it looks really cute, I think. But I'm not like hyper impressed. Do I even want to know? <laughs> I don't care about these. I'm sorry. I'm surprised this one didn't get two dies. I wish it would have. This one, I'm guessing. That one thing I never liked about it was the gold. Sometimes you want to wear it with something that isn't gold. So I hope that's the change. Oh, it's not. I don't understand. What is... Is the change the flower? Gotta make this like... Yeah, okay. The change is the flower. <sighs> it's okay. It's okay. It's just fine. It's like, it's fine. It's not the best. It, it, it doesn't pack a punch. Okay, this one. This one I died kind of weird because the top part never died that intensely. Like, the black doesn't get that intense. I wonder if it's gonna die the arm thing. Yes, it did. It mainly dies the arm things. I actually like this. I think it's really cute. I like how it ties the arm thingy. Kind of like looks more like a tattoo. I don't know if that is like enough to be favorites level, but I really like it. Although I do kind of wish this one would get dyed too. But I do quite like it. It dies the arm thing and I think it dies the string up here too. Yes. I actually really like it, I'm sorry. Let's check on the rest of the set. It dyes these flowers, I think. Yeah, it does. I actually really like that too. That's really pretty. Like, is that not so pretty? I really like that. Let's see how this one... Okay, I think it's this side gets dyed. So both do. 
That's just fine. The shoes. I think it's these. How do they manage to make this one two dies? Okay, it dies the bottom of it as well. It's just fine. What about the hat? Will it die the flowers? It does. I think this whole set is really nice. I mean, the gloves, uh, you know, I'd say like these gloves are nothing special. The shoes are kind of whatever, but the top and bottom is really cute. Okay, so this one too. So if we just dye it one color, looks like that. Two colors. Okay, so it's just those like little trim details. I do once again want to see kind of the whole set. This one still only has one dye, which makes sense. Like why? What else would you really do with that? this one. I'm mostly curious about the shoes. Because if you just dye it one, I think it stays wood on the bottom. <gasps> yes, it dyes the bottom of them. That's really fun, actually. <laughs> I like that. I really like that. I think the outfit itself is not like super impressive, but the shoes. The shoes have a spot. Oh my god, I still have so much to get through. Okay. Let's remove all of this. I don't care about this. I don't like this top, but just to see. There's... There we go. This one I'm excited about. The orange part always stayed the same. And now you can dye it. I would say the gloves are one of the things I'm most excited about with this because... Like, okay, let's try that again. Usually, you would dye these and you'd get stuck with this orange bow and it wouldn't you wouldn't be able to match your outfit. But now, you're like, okay, dye the bow. Oh, yes, this has to go. This is, has to be one of the best ones because now you get to just have these long Sailor Moon-esque gloves uh, that you can use for anything. This is a Mog Station item, by the way. Actually, I think it was an event item. That's great, though. Like, how cute. It doesn't match, though. Like, what the heck? The gloves died differently than the body that's so weird because they're like a different texture it just became disappointing but i don't know if that was always a problem i have no clue i think it was i think this texture's always been an issue these have two dies as well how okay let's get back into the okay it's just this little cravat thing I don't really care that much about the gloves. Let's just stick to the... I've t okay. This I can guess what's gonna do, but... Yep. As expected. I actually really like these. I think that makes it super cute. Obviously, the color swap doesn't do that much, like... Do you like it on the left or the right? Like, it's not... But it's really cute. Kinda wanna see about the gloves and the shoes. That's how these die.
Okay. It dyes the underside in the bow. That's fun. Uh, it's these. We think we already know what'll happen to these. Yep. It's just the same. And it's like, which side do you want what? I love it, though. I love it. Fantastic. Oh my god, wait. Maybe just... Oh, I was gonna say, if I swap it, will it not match? It doesn't. It, like, does but doesn't. That's crazy. Because I think it matched better before. Maybe not. No, I think it did. It's hard to say. I like the whole set. It's fantastic. Is there a hat with this one? Oh, there is. No, it's not. It's this one. 10 out of 10. I love it. The whole set. Okay. That's great. That It's so fun. It's giving Alice in Wonderland now, but I love it. I love it all. Okay, let's go back. Just see how this one dies. It's fine. Dress. I actually quite like this one. I do still hate how this bottom part is kind of weird, but it's pretty cute. Let's see the bottoms on that one. Okay, that's that's fun. Don't think I'm gonna make it a. Uh, favorite just because I do like these boots a lot just because like I don't really like the outfit that much this is the male version the male version got better boots they basically look the same as the female one but they start off black on black and before the two die system if you didn't like the red trim you were kind of screwed until they release the male boots for all genders. Okay. We've looked at all. One, two. Yeah, we figured that. Oh, wow, this one has two dies? So with just one die, it keeps the gradient. With two, you get to choose the color of the gradient. Super fun. I know a lot of people really liked this top. I think just because I know lots of people love this top, I'm going to put it in there because it does die really nicely. That you get to choose the gradient is really cool. I'm guessing the rest of it just that way too. Yep. Same deal. The shoes are kind of ugly, so what happens to these? Okay, I think this is an improvement. I'm gonna just say this whole outfit is improved. Except the stupid hat. <laughs> the hat changes the crown. Those gr <laughs> what? Why is this double die? That's funny. Okay. Okay. This is the lightning outfit. I don't know if it was ever an event or not, but it's in the log station. It's okay. I have high hopes for this one. So originally it died like this. Just this kind of inside part, some details. Now, okay, you get to change the cape. That's fun. I like it.
There's so many of these, guys. I'm actually getting kind of tired. Oh my god, wait. Yes! <gasps> yes! We have also been wanting this part to be diable for a long time, I think. Like, imagine you can make it the same color now. Because I think previously, you just make it like that color. Like, you can only do one, and you're just stuck with black. But now the whole thing, this has to be a favorite. Like, that's such a win. Okay, originally you only get to do the jacket. Now the jacket and the inner shirt. It's good, it's really good. I'm just not that excited about it because I don't really care about that much. Okay, this one originally, the straps, it looks like in the shirt. Now, inner shirt. The straps still die, but they die kind of weird. I guess technically they always died weird, but I think it looks nice, actually. I think it looks really cute. I'm gonna put this one in with a question mark because I think it dies really nicely. I'm adding so many of these to the list, I just, I don't know. need to change the list to numbered instead of bullet points. I have 18 already, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to do something about that. How it died before. Looks like just the base pieces. Now, I can't tell. It's just this. That's actually disappointing. It would have been cool if the flowers died or like the obi, the like waistband thing. Um, but it looks like the only part that really changes is the string. Super disappointing. It's going in the disappointing category. Out of curiosity, with these being double die, here's how it used to die. What does it even do? I don't get it. Like, I actually don't get this one. I need to change it to, like, blue. What? What? What's changing? Oh my god, it's... Th 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 <laughs> That's it, guys. It's that on the rings. That's so ridiculous. It's the rings. No, that's actually the worst. That whole outfit. <laughs> Hold on, how does this one even have two dies? How does this one... <laughs> it's fine, it's just... They had to do something. Okay, um... <laughs> None of these are diable. Oh god. Here we are. In the big whammy zone. Basically everything in the, uh, log station became diable. Here's how it used to die, the apron stayed white. Here's how it dies now. I actually saw someone do... Actually, let's just do this. Black on black, and it looks really cool. Like, I think the cool thing about this now is you can also just... I don't like it like that too much, but... I think it is nice that you can change the colors a bit. I don't know if I'd say it's a favorite, but how would it look if we do all white? What if this is black? Well, that's the part that's always black. That looks kind of weird. Yeah, I think it's nice. I don't think it's a favorite, so I'm not even gonna... Oh, let's see. The other, I will say one of the things I love is the shoes. I think the shoes are actually great that you can change the inside color 
because I think that'll help you match it with more stuff now. So I don't really think the dress is one, but I think the shoes are. So it looks like the original die style does affect the under part, but let's just see. Okay, it looks like all the metal, all of the metal gets dyed. It's okay, it's okay. The main thing we have to try with this is this. Yeah, it's the metal again, but I actually kind of like that because if you've ever seen my outfit that I do sometimes, it's... Let's give it like a really bright... That's so pretty, uh, but the one outfit that I wear, sometimes the metal um does look very... Like, there's one part here on the side that looks kind of bronzy, so I like that you can control it and make it super... Oops, wrong one. You can kind of just make it whatever color you want it to be. I do wish we had a, other options besides these whites, because I feel like pure white ends up being the best choice for silver, which is kind of awkward because it's expensive. I don't care about this outfit, but I'll show you just for the sake of it. I think I bought this just for like the hat. So actually, let's look at the hat. This one I'm really happy with the way that it's changed. Because those flowers used to always be purple and I like never wore it because it didn't match. And now it'll match stuff. This one I'm excited about. So originally it dies like this, how about now? Okay, so it's these little trim areas. It's fine. I don't care about this one. Just gonna do like a quick show and tell. Oh, that's actually really cool. The gradient's really neat. I don't care about this one either. I do think the way it dies is kind of cool, but it's whatever. This is another one I bought just for the, uh, the bow. It dies nicely. I like it this way. It's pretty. Let's check out the bow. Oh, oh my god, the bow is in my inventory somewhere. This hairstyle is not the best for it, but you'll notice it dyes these, um, I think it dyes these speckled bits a bit. Not sure, it's hard to tell. Like, what is it even doing? I don't know what it's doing. You know what, your guess is as good as mine. What is it even doing? I don't... I don't know. <laughs> we also get this... Ms. Hall Lady. Which dies the outer part now. Used to just be gold. Yeah, let's go back to our costumes. This one, I'm excited to see how this one changes. So originally, like so. Um, 
Wait a second. Are you for real? <laughs> I sh it should dye the flowers. That's another disappointment. This is one of those where it's like, why did they even bother giving it two dyes? If this is what they were gonna do. Okay, that's how that dies. It's fine. It's kind of like these trim area, or uh, like this trim in this uh, bag, I think. It's fine. It's nothing amazing. This is another one I do not care about. It's whatever. This one, I actually really like how it dies. You get to choose the color of the inner shirt. Look how cute that is. And because of the way that the outer shirt dies, sometimes it matches kind of like this one does like if I swap it it's not as good but like this because there's lighter colors mixed in like this pink with like white on the inside oh. nope that's the wrong one pick the wrong side I mean obviously it starts off white but it's really cute or maybe like the brass color where is the brass one is this brass? It is. I was hoping it would be less intense. Either way, I, I think this one deserves a place. Let's quick look at the other dirndl pieces. Um, it looks like mainly the bow. So this one's not that impressive, but it's fine. What about the shoes? Normally it just dyes the shoes. Yes! Okay, I love the shoes. I love that you get to dye the socks now. The fact that you get to dye the socks now is really cute. I think that's a really nice touch, too. The Durndal outfit is such a winner. Okay, this one you're just working with the bow. The skirt doesn't even have to because it's just plain, so... I think this one is a win, too. Because... I think... It used to be that the inside never stopped being red. So... You just got stuck with the red details. But now... It matches. All of the details match. Uh, this one is a big win, I think. This one has to go in the favorites. Let's check the other pieces that come with it. Uh, Eastern Lady Errant. This, these ones I, I've seen, I don't think. They, the way they die is just okay. I wish the nail polish changed, too. Eastern. Okay, this one. You get to change the color of this, which I think is actually a good thing because I think there were times that people would be wearing, uh, like if I had a top that was gold, 
sometimes I would be upset that it, this part didn't match, where now you kind of have some options, because there's a lot of pieces, I think, that use this kind of gold shade. Now you can make it match anything, so I think that's a huge win too. Sometimes the small details like that can be really annoying. I've never really liked these shoes, but let's just see. Yeah, so the bottom dies. Doesn't have to be red anymore. And finally, the hat. I'm interested to see how this one goes. I'm guessing it's going to be this bow. Yep. I feel like the hat kind of looks ugly if it's not black. Straight jacket. We'll just quick show this one. Okay, that's great. Love it. The jacket is the part I like more. So originally, just this outside part. Will it this shirt be dyed? <gasps> yes! I always feel like it's such a win when they dye like the actual inner piece rather than something stupid like the buttons or the necklace. That's a win. This one, they don't have that many options, so it looks like it's just the uh, ties. These are great, too. Oh, I'm tempted to put the street set. So the way this one died was just the nails before, apparently. Now you get one whole glove and the nails. Love. This has to- I'm this another favorite. I have to say, I'm glad that I only have a few that I find, like, super disappointing. Um, so far, most stuff has been pretty winner, winner, chicken dinner. Can't believe we made it through all that. We do now uh, have to look at some bottoms. Because uh, I know there is a bottom that... I really was disappointed. Curious about what that healer bottom is now since I like the top so much. It's not this. The artifact one, where is it? Do I not have it in here? Did I take it out? Maybe I took it out because I like don't ever wear it. Wait, these are so hot. That's kind of funny how they die, though. It's not so bad like that. It's not the color you think you're gonna get, though. Okay, but specifically... I want to look at, um... How would this... Is this just the belt? It is. So, these bottoms are so disappointing because, like... You see it die like normal, and you kind of see like it just two-tones itself. And you would hope that when you dye it like this... Like, let me just pick like a really different color so you can see. <laughs> you get the trim. You would think you'd get like inner, outer. Like this inner color would stay pink, the outer color would go blue. It's the trim and the button, and I found that super disappointing. So... Sorry, disappointment. Let's just check a few of the others to see how they double die. That's just like the rope and the cuffs. Um, this one was one a lot of people liked. Ugh, nope. It's whatever. This is gonna be the belt again. Yeah. Okay, this one I have to see. 
because this is really a cute outfit. It's the belt and the scarf. Uh, I actually do like that, that you can change that. I think that's a good change. What about these? Is it gonna be the buttons? I swear to god. It's the buttons. <laughs> it's like, why even do it then? What's this one gonna be? Maybe this top part? That's kind of frustrating that it stays that way. <gasps> yeah, I actually really like that because now you can make it the same color and it's all matchy. That's really good. I'm tempted to put that one on the list because it's like so nice that it changed. <sighs> Fine, I'll put it. Curious about Queen Trell. Let's see how this one goes. Is it just the trim on the belt? Yeah, that's kind of disappointing, I'm not gonna lie. It would have been better if it was like the trim on the skirt itself, because it's this dark color that you don't get to change, or literally if you could have the skirt be one color and the leggings be another one. This is a disappointment. Obviously, there's more glamour than what I have in my glamour dresser, but this is a win, too, getting to choose two colors. I don't think I'm going to put this on my list, though, because I just don't like the outfit that much. Really? Hold on. Oh, this is one die. I'm crazy. Sorry. I didn't notice. This one I'm curious about because... Okay, so it looks like before, the skirt did not die. Oh, it did. Then what changed? The belt? I think it's like the belt and some of the inside, de or some of this detailing. Now that's another win because being able to try to match these to your outfit instead of having them be this stupid brown color. Expeditioners. Okay, I think that's uh, mostly what we need to see from here. Lame. I still am super disappointed that these ones didn't get any dies at all. Like, they didn't get two dies. It's just because this one should be two dies, right? And you should be able to have the second die be the straps. We're gonna just check one more time some of the bottoms. I think this one is fun, although kind of wish this middle part died as well. This one's okay. Who even cares about those? This one I also... I really like how this dies. I like that you get to dye the waistband now. I actually think that's a good, a good one. Wait, you don't get to dye the waistband. Am I crazy? Okay, never mind. I thought you got to change the waistband now. You don't? And we looked at those already. Don't care about those. Looked at most of these. How does this one have two dyes? Like, what are we going to change about that? Don't tell me it's the buttons. It's not those buttons. What about this is two dies? Am I crazy? I don't see anything. I don't know, guys. Is it the buttons, but they just die weird? Like, what? 
what part of this is two dogs? Somebody tell me, I don't know. Oh my god. Like, what is the point? That's what I don't get. What is the point of that? Whatever. This one I think is, um... Hmm. Oh, it actually dies the top of the skirt. I still wish it would dye the whole skirt. It's kind of ugly no matter what you do. Like, the skirt itself isn't ugly. You kind of make it cute, but you have to just, like, accept the fact that it's brown, and I don't know if changing the top of it's really gonna help. Okay, the place we need to go is here. That one we checked already. Yeah, this is like the, the trim. This is probably the gold part, yep. This one is super disappointing. So when you first dye it for whatever reason, it goes from green to gold. Why? Why? But now you do this, and you would expect that by using two dyes, you could choose the color of this trim. No, you don't get to. It stayed as one- it actually uses one die still. Like, what the heck? It's disappointing that it didn't get two dies. I don't understand why it didn't. This one I think is stupid, too. It's just this. Just like the top. It's just that. Like, why? Like, why? I'm gonna have to put the fairy tale bottom because it doesn't die. Okay, how does this one go? This one I was actually pretty happy with because I think if you just dye it with one dye, yeah, you just change the shorts. So being able to dye the, uh, pants part. It's kind of cool. They do lose their sheerness, though. Don't they? Mm, they do. Like, here, they have this illusion as if you're wearing, like, a sheer tight, right? And they lose that completely and become matte. So I think that's actually disappointing. That's really actually disappointing. And this one is the one that, like, they should have done with so many other stuff. Clearly, how are you gonna make this two dies? I suppose you could make the waistband a different color, but, like, why? Okay, I think that's pretty much everything that I have here in my, uh, glamour dresser. Wanna look at the Gomtharian again? <laughs> That's ugly. <laughs> I don't think it's bad, I just think it's ugly when you die like that. I'm just like, don't, don't do that. I wish these had two dies, that would be so amazing. Oh, some of the new stuff they added? Oh gosh. This is really exciting for me because I believe these are the Troya ones. And I think it's really cool. Actually, you know what's even better? Is the gloves. Let me just remove these. Watch this. Right? These, I believe the Troya gear was not even diable to begin with. But let's just show you. Let's just put these at zero, okay? You do one color and it just changes the wrapping and you're like, okay. But maybe your outfit isn't great, it doesn't match. Making it all black looks so cool. It looks really cool. What if we make it all white? Not as cool, but you could go for a mummy look. I just think this one's really nice. 
crocodile skin arm guards. I also have this skirt. Amazing. It's funny because it's like kind of tattered, but weirdly, it's almost turned into like a princess skirt now. You could use it that way, I think. Okay, I have a long list of favorites. But out of all of the favorites, which ones am I most excited about? Definitely the Theophany robe. This looks so weird with all this stuff. The spring dress, which, good luck finding that in my inventory. Um, the Skyworker's singlet, for sure, because you get to change the tattoos. For whatever reason, I really liked those Isle Farmhands ones. This, I thought it was super cute. I also really like the Summer Flame set. Super excited about the witch's gloves. The Valentine set was really cute. The Strife Fest was really exciting. I'm trying to just pick out which ones I think were the best. The best of the best. Because I've got 25 here and I think that might be too much for a video. The whole Durndal set was good. I think the Eastern Lady Erin set was especially good. So there's a lot of good stuff, for sure. A lot of good uh, double dies. I think in my free time, uh, I'll try and narrow that down more for a video. And then for the disappointments, I think I'm also going to add the PvP tech gear. And they're just going to be added uh, because they're super disappointing that they remained one die. Like, most of the two dies that I added were ones that were like stupid stuff that you're like, I wish it did this, I wish it did that. Ones where they just changed the buttons, but there wasn't something better about it to change. I didn't bother putting on because I just don't see the point. But if it was something where it was like they changed the buttons instead of changing something obvious that they should have changed, disappointing. So thanks for coming along with me for the ride of looking through all of this glam. Obviously, there's more glam in the game. I can only fit 800 in my dresser, and there are some pieces that I don't have because I don't wear them that often or just wasn't super interested in them, like the Queen Trell top I don't have, but I saw my friend wear it. Uh, she made it part of her honeybee outfit. It was actually really cute, so I feel like that one maybe dies solidly. I don't remember. I think I'm also super excited about the Frontier dress dying so well, like, but I don't have any of the rest of the Frontier set. I don't think I have, like, the bottoms or anything. I do think I have the ribbon, but I doubt that the ribbon is two dies. That would be kind of weird, wouldn't it? Yeah. So, I- do I have the shoes? I think I do. Hold on. Let's check these out. I didn't really check out that many shoes, did I? Wow, okay, I actually love that because not being able to change the tip of the shoe. <gasps> Guys, wait, 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 wait a second. Um. <gasps> How did I not think of this? I have always wanted in this game a set of pumps just like this. And the frontier pumps were like so close, so close, but because of the two-tone, they didn't work. But now, you just dye it the same color. I need to calm down. This is an ASMR video. Holy crap. Holy crap. I'm so excited. I need to add this to my list. This is something I have always, always wanted. And now we have it, and I didn't even realize it until now. We need to look through the shoes. Okay, let me look through the shoes really quick, and then we will uh, end the video. So let's not worry about uh, any of the shoes that are like part of uh, like artifact gear stuff. Let's just quick see what do these do. These are actually kind of ugly. Why do I have these? Um. These, I, I said I wouldn't look at the artifact ones, but I've got to see. Okay, 
Okay, it's the trim. I'm trying to basically find, like, where's the craft? I gotta go to the next page, like, crafted stuff. This one is just the, uh, ties, nothing too special. I feel like this one I won't even be able to figure out what they... Oh, it's the piece on the back. Okay, this one could be good. No, it's just the ties. This one is also the ties. Surprised the cleaner stuff didn't get two dies. Maybe the top did and I'm crazy. Did the top get two dies and I just didn't notice? Cleaner top, cleaner top. Where is the cleaner top? Here it is. No, it's not. That's so weird. Rebel boots. Unimpressed. These would be great with two dies, wouldn't they? <laughs> is it gonna die the knife? It is. I would say that's a step up. They still look so dirty, though. Those are another ones that I, like, never wear. Why do I have them? These are super cute. I like this one a lot. I also never wear these. They have improved. Just curious to see if it's all of I don't know why I have these. I don't like them that much. Kinda dumb. <laughs> this is another one where it's like, what did it change? That tiny piece. These could be good. Yeah, I just changed this little string. It's whatever. Casual boots. They're fine. Calfskin rider. Let's see. It's the uh, laces. That's nice, though. Also, the laces. I actually kind of like these. Sometimes I wear them on my, like, botanist. Laces and socks. It's just okay. Are the- oh my god, wait. If the laces on these die... <gasps> okay. These are a huge win as well. The laces die. Okay, this has to go in the win category. Like, I didn't care about the top, but the, the shoes are so good. It's just the, the anklet. Whatever. How will this one be? It's again, kind of that little strappy strap part. Stringy. <laughs> it's that little piece. Right there. Right here. Stupid. These are probably just ugly. They're ugly. How would these even? Oh, it's the bottom. Okay, I see. You get to choose your sock color. Whatever. I have- I should get rid of some of these shoes, because I just- 
I never wear them. I don't care about them. I probably will never wear them. These are cute. Okay, what's the, uh... It's the jewel. These are actually mob station ones that... Okay, that makes sense, because they're always kind of two-toned. Okay. I think that's everything. The shoes I'm easily the most excited about are the Frontier pumps, because we now have an actual pump that's just one color. Just like a cute, basic high heel. Basic in a good way. Like, basic as in like a staple. Staple high heel. And then the other ones that were the best were obviously these Shepherds, Isle Shepherds ones. Okay, now I'm going to end the video. <laughs> because it's almost time for me to go and have dinner. So, thank you for joining me on this journey of checking through all of the clams that I currently have. Picking out the ones that I'm most excited about. And the ones that I'm most disappointed about. And I hope you enjoyed watching. So, please consider subscribing if you are not yet asleep. Good night!